Greetings ladies and gentlemen, hope you are doing well. This is mathematics and in this video we want to look at this question coming from 2020 General Certificate of Education GCE Paper 1 question number 4. The question reads factorize completely 6 ax minus 4 ay minus 3 bx plus 2 by. You're doing what? Factorizing and it must be completely. Well, this is algebra, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, now I want you to pause the video first. Factorize on your own way where you are, and then you compare with what I'm going to give you. Let's start. We are taught to factorize. Now, remember, we have different types of factorization. We have common factorization, we have difference of two squares, we have factorization by grouping and quadratic factorization. How do you identify? Quadratic factorization has got three terms. Difference of two squares has got two terms. Grouping has got four terms. Look at this. How many terms do we have? One, two, three, four. So this is grouping. Well, you'll be able to copy the question the way it is. 6ax minus 4ay minus 3bx plus 2by. Grouping means you pair them. Sometimes they can be mixed around or they can be uh, swapped. This one is here, this one is here. So before you group them, make sure that you collect terms that have got like uh, variables in them. That's when you'll be able to start the factorization. Looking at this, I can group them the way they are because I can see common uh, terms in here. I can also see the common terms in there. So I'll just be able to group them like this. Just like that. Then you apply common factorization. What is common here? What do you see that is common? You start with the numbers. What is common? Well, the number that can go into 6 and 4 is 2. So 2 is common. In terms of variables or letters, I've got a, a, so it is common. So 2a is common. Then 2 into 3, I mean 6, it will be 3. And then this a, I uh, will just be able to remain with x minus 2 into 4, it will be 2. The a is already here, so I'll remain with the y. Have you seen? Minus. Come to this side. What is common? Numbers, nothing is common. Variables or letters, I've got b. So b outside. What will remain here? 3x. 3x. But this plus here, this is where you need to be very careful. So if you put plus here, if you put additional sign here, it means you are going to change the statement because there's a minus here. Because when you say minus times positive here or negative times positive, you're not going to get this. So for you to get this negative here or for you to get this positive here, I should have a negative there. So that when I say negative times negative, it will be positive. So be careful there. So B is common, I'll remain with 2Y, like this, close. Check what we have in brackets if they are the same. Are they the same? 3X minus 2Y, 3X minus 2Y, they're the same, right? Just pick one. So since they are the same, pick one, 3X minus 2Y. Also pair those that are outside. So we have 2a minus b, like this. You are done. That is the way we factorize by grouping. 
I hope you've learned something. Remember to share the video, uh, follow me on Facebook, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and also follow me on TikTok. The names are Evans Kalunga or Introductory Learning. Those are the names. Thank you. I appreciate for your support. Bye-bye.